Good afternoon. Thank you for joining us. I'm Heidi Laga. Former President Donald Trump just wrapped up his event here in Tucson. This was his first campaign event since Tuesday's debate with Vice President Kamala Harris. Kega 9's Ryan Fish joins us live at Ron Sad Music Hall downtown with more from this event that just wrapped up. What can you tell us, Ryan? That's right, Heidi. Uh, just within the last half hour or so is when uh, Trump wrapped up. He, he talked about a lot of issues here today, but I think uh, one of the headlines that will come out of this, and uh, you referenced the debate just a couple of days ago, well, he, as he did on Truth Social earlier today, declared a monumental victory in that debate, and he shut down the idea of a rematch with Harris. There will be no third debate. It's too late anyway. The voting's already begun. you got to go out and vote. Yeah, Trump uh, went after uh, the vice president and ABC News saying the moderators of the debate were biased against him. That's a message I heard from supporters here today, though at least a couple of them told me they felt Kamala Harris was able to get under his skin a little bit and thought he should agree to another debate before Election Day. But it appears Trump instead now fully focused on campaign events and rallies like this one. Uh, he focused his comments today in part on rising housing costs and inflation, an issue affecting Arizonans. Uh, he says his plan is to smash energy costs, taxes, and regulations in order to bring down housing costs and interest rates. And he also tied the issue of immigration and illegal crossings to uh, housing costs going up. And a mass deportation effort will be part of his plan to uh, help not only with uh, safety in the country, uh, but also housing costs.